Barabbas or Jesus? At the time Jesus was arrested and falsely accused by the Jewish leaders, a man called Barabbas was in prison. He was leader of a group of rebels who started an uprising in the city in which several people were murdered. His sentence was death. After questioning Jesus, Pilate, the Roman governor, told the chief priests and the crowd, I find no basis for a charge against this man. He sent Jesus off to face trial by the ruler Herod Antipas who mocked him but could not find a charge against Jesus. So Jesus was returned to Pilate. Pilate called together the chief priests, the rulers and the people, and said, I have examined Jesus in your presence and have found no basis for your charges against him. Jesus has done nothing to deserve death. I am going to punish Jesus and then release him. But they insisted, he stirs up the people all over Judea by his teaching. He started in Galilee and has come all the way here. Now it was the governor's custom at the Passover festival to release a prisoner chosen by the crowd. Pilate asked them, which one do you want me to release to you? Barabbas, or Jesus who is called the Messiah. The chief priests and the elders urged the crowd to ask for Barabbas and to have Jesus executed. So which of the two do you want me to release? Pilate asked a second time. Barabbas, they shouted. What shall I do with Jesus who is called the Messiah? They all answered, crucify him. Why? What crime has he committed? But they shouted louder, crucify him. When Pilate saw that he was getting nowhere, but instead an uproar was starting, he took water and washed his hands in front of the crowd. I am innocent of this man's blood. It is your responsibility. Jesus was then led away. Barabbas was released from prison and handed over to the crowd. Instead of facing a death sentence he was set free. Jesus was mocked and flogged. Then he was led off to be crucified. If you like this video give it a thumbs up. Share and leave a comment. Subscribe.